The Heroic John Chapman John Allen Chapman was an American combat controller in the United States Air Force who was posthumously awarded the Medal of Honor on August 22, 2018 for his actions in the Battle of Takhargar during the war in Afghanistan. He is the first airman to receive the Medal of Honor since the Vietnam War. He was inducted into the Hall of Heroes on August 23, 2018 and posthumously promoted to Master Sergeant on the following day. Chapman was also the first Air Force combat controller to be awarded the Air Force Cross, which was subsequently upgraded to the Medal of Honor. John Chapman was born July 14, 1965, in Springfield, Massachusetts, to Eugene and Terry Chapman, and grew up in Windsor Locks, Connecticut. He had two sisters, Lori and Tammy, and a brother, Kevin. He graduated from Windsor Locks High School in 1983. Chapman enlisted in the United States Air Force on September 27, 1985, and was trained as an information systems operator. His first assignment was with the 1987th Information Systems Squadron at Lowry Air Force Base, Colorado, from February 1986 to June 1989. From there, Chapman cross-trained in the combat control career field and served with the 1721st Combat Control Squadron at Pope Air Force Base, North Carolina from August 1990 to November 1992. He was a Special Tactics team member with the 320th Special Tactics Squadron at Kadena Air Base on Okinawa from November 1992 to October 1995. His final assignment was with the 24th Special Tactics Squadron at Pope Air Force Base. Then jump to March 4th, 2002. Chapman and members of the United States Navy SEALs were taking part in Operation Anaconda. An MH-47E Chinook call sign Razor 3 came under enemy fire, causing a Navy SEAL P-01 Neil Roberts to fall out during an insertion under fire. The helicopter landed four and a half miles away from where Roberts was killed. Once on the ground, Chapman provided directions to another helicopter to pick them up. He and the team volunteered to rescue Roberts from the enemy stronghold. Upon returning to recover Roberts, the team came under fire from three directions. Chapman charged forward, killing two enemy soldiers and advancing toward the defensive fighting position from minimal personal cover and succumbed to multiple wounds. His engagement and destruction of the first enemy position and advancement to the second enabled his team to move to cover and break enemy contact. He is credited with saving the lives of the entire rescue team. Make sure to like, comment, and hit follow. And remember, if it's more interesting, you can find it here. Thanks, guys.